All right, here we go, you two. This right here is day number six, and I'm headed to work on my day off. And you talking about somebody tired. Whew. If it looks a little different inside of here, that is because I am riding my M109 that has been customized. I don't get to play with this bike too much. I'm always riding the F6B and travel the gold wing. This is more of my bar hopping bike. If I decide to pull that bad Oscar out, hopefully we don't get caught in no kind of rainstorm. But I like his old bike. This used to be my travel horse of choice because all I had was this and sport bikes. But when I wanted to travel, I jump on a 109, strap bags all on it, do my thing. You what they say, run with your bung. Guy asked me, he said, man, we gonna go to Key West, but I gotta have Busa. He said, I guess I can't go with you, can I? I said, why not? He said, well, I gotta have Busa. I said, man, ride, that's your bike, you ride it, dog. I don't care what you ride, as long as you can tolerate it. I mean, I've done it. I ain't never did Key West on a sport bike, but I went to Murder Beach on it. And when I did, it broke me down, boy. Whew. That damn bike broke me in half going down through there. If anybody would have came to me with just a little bit of money, they probably could have got that dog on, uh, that high boots off of me. That's how upset I was. I was that thing hurt me, boy, Lord. I, I just don't like riding, traveling on sport bikes. But as my granddaddy would say, when you know better, you do better. Now, once I got my pocketbook up and could afford to do a little something differently uh, and wreck my uh, wreck my high boosa, I ended up uh, getting this 06 Suzuki Boulevard. And I liked it so much, I kept it. And I would do a little bit to it. It kind of morphed into what it is now. It's got bags on it. It's got ape hangers on it. It's got a, a tall sissy bar on it. It's got a back wing and stereo. I got a few uh, performance upgrades, but I have not broken the motor. It's got uh, 47,000 miles, 47.9 to be exact, on the original clutch. And I used to race the shit out of this bike, boy. You talking about somebody we used to damn jump on them sport bikes and give them hell. Yeah, I used to damn race them boys on this. They hated to see me coming, you hear me? Go some bike boys right there. Let's go get us a Subway sandwich, go get this. Oh Lord, we got a whole crowd in there. This ain't gonna go well. This ain't gonna go too good. We'll see what they say. Hello? They was super busy in this subway. Maybe I should have came a little sooner. But that's all right. It'll be like that sometime. There's a few more places I can go before I get to the workplace. And that's exactly what I'm going to do. If I can get on this I'll Kill Your Highway. If I can get on now, kill your highway without any kind of problem. Yeah, we got a UT home game. My son got a game. I probably should have took off tonight. Woo, but they trying to give old slappy dog that money. I need that money go on my next road trip, y'all.
I'm almost. Am I late? Nah, I ain't too late. I got plenty of time. I'm a little bit slappy late. But I'm here to work on this Friday. My off day. It must be my long weekend. But I'm taking off Saturday and Sunday. I don't give a daggum. Probably won't get nothing done like I want to. But I, you got to do something, right? I got to tell some people money ain't everything. Sometimes you got to get some time for yourself. But I told him I would, so I am, and I did. I'm going to go run this, and I'm going to try to get home, take a little two or three hour nap, go shoot down there and see my son at the Carson Newman game, get on back, then I'm just going to relax. I'm just going to, I mean, I'm just going to daggum relax all the way out Saturday. It might not even leave the daggum house, do you hear me? Might not even leave the house. But here is my dog on hook him slappy. We don't hook him too hard on this bike right here. I hadn't rode this bike so long that it lost a few pounds of air. You know, you should check your air pressure. I know everybody ain't gonna check them every day. Especially if you got a bike that ain't got no air pressure gauge. But daggone, I check this bike every time I get on it because I don't ride it that much alright you guys I'm going down the interstate let's ride hey thanks for watching another episode of Slappy Adventures please like share and comment and don't forget to hit the subscribe button <laughs> hey, stay tuned for more videos like these. Thanks for watching.